Hi, my name is Ido Katz. I'm an archaeologist and a tour guide. I work over here at uh, Tel Kursi as the manager of the area, manager of the excavation. Uh, the Tel Kursi itself uh, that we're standing on is an interesting tell, multi-layered tell. has many layers, probably going back to the Bronze Age according to the um, pottery that we're finding in here. The surface was a Syrian village that we're seeing all around us. Uh, right under it, uh, we're seeing already parts of the Crusader period of about a thousand years ago and a lot of pottery of that period is coming out. The next period that really shows itself nicely over here is the Iron Age that already goes back to the Biblical period. Exciting things are coming out. We believe that this tell was a very active city right by the sea, by the, sea, by the uh, sea of Galilee, a very active port. Also, looking down at the valley, you will see right away that we're looking at a delta of a very uh, strong, at least in the past, uh, strong stream of water that came from the Golan Heights, from the east, going west into the, uh, into the Sea of Galilee, carrying a lot of water. Meanwhile, it created a very nice passageway for people to go inland into all of the ancient kingdoms, uh, going east and northeast. So this port over here may be people crossing over from the uh, western side of the Sea of Galilee, the area of Tiberias today crossing over to this side, getting down off their boats here, maybe going into the market, maybe resting over here, and from here going inland towards Assyria, towards Akkad, Sumer, all the ancient kingdoms further east and northeast uh, from here on the main highway or so that was here going east-west. Not too many roads going east-west. More roads in our area goes north-south. And therefore, sitting by the bank of the river, uh, by the bank of the lake over here, and having this access inland, both together were very important for the development of this uh, city. Uh, and we're still searching for it. The amazing thing about it is that we're the first people ever excavating this site. Tel Kursi was never excavated before, and we're looking forward to an amazing season over here with great finds.